Hey, you guys. I know this is a different position, but I have to be honest. I am so sick. And I still want to shoot this video, but I, like, literally cannot sit up. I'm so tired. But, Valley Violet Perfume Dot, welcome to my channel. I know I have new subscribers. Thank you for joining my Perfume Mafia. <laughs> This is a different type of situation, but let's get into it, girl. So I am doing a holiday gift guide, and I want to share with you guys five cents, four that I own, one that hopefully I own soon, that I really feel like if you're shopping for someone that's like that Instagram, love social media, trendy, fashionista girl, and you want to get them a fragrance because you're a fragrance lover or they're a fragrance lover, get it from these four houses because I know that they truly appreciate them. And even if they don't like the scent, even if they hate the scent, they're still gonna be posted up, taking pictures and keep it in their vanity just so they can post a shelfie or something like that. So these are my five Instagram worthy for the Instagram girl influencer fragrances. The first thing that you need to do though is hit subscribe, hit notification bell so you can actually follow me and know when I'm having different content coming out because I have so much lined up for you guys. And go ahead and follow me on Instagram as well. It's Valley on the Perfume Dot, and I will have it listed in the product description. The first fragrance that I have that I really feel like you should purchase if you're an Instagram influencer is going to be from the House of Byredo. I forget the name of the perfumer behind this, but God, he is an attractive guy. And this is a Swedish brand. It's a niche brand. It's di very difficult to find, but the performance and the scents are so unique. I absolutely love it. The only one that I own, though, is Blanche. Hopefully, I'll change that soon, but this is a holy grail scent for me. But anything that you purchase from them, first of all, the quality is amazing. And I just know if they're influencer, if they like that kind of thing, then they will absolutely love this scent. Second one, of course... Chanel, Chanel, Chanel. Chanel is so popular, it will always be popular. I can't imagine a day when Chanel fragrances is not popular, and especially if number five isn't the most sold fragrance in the world. This is the number five au premier, um, but this is just a classic look. I mean, this is an iconic look for fragrance. The white background, the black, the black lettering, the classic Chanel logo. Every influencer, social media girl loves this kind of look and would love to take pictures with this and hopefully love how it smells too. That's the second one. The third one's going to be from Jo Malone. This lady knows how to do it and notice that all of these kind of have the same look as the Chanel, except for the last one that I don't own that I'm gonna share with you, the black on the white uh, background. But this one, beautiful niche fragrance line, wearable scents great lovely scents they're unisex as well um so whether they're a man or a woman same with byredo they can find something that works for them and same with the next one that i'm going to list heads up they don't have it here in the states but i heard that joe malone's doing a collaboration with zara i don't know how that's going to be as far as fragrance as far as packaging if it's comparable but that may be an alternative if you're looking for a lower price point so the fourth one is going to be from Derek Lom. Now this I believe is like very difficult to find. I don't know if it's in regular stock anymore because I've been seeing it trickle in to the discount spots. But love this fragrance, love the packaging. Again, another magnetic top, just like Byredo. Um, and just clean, sleek. This is a New York based, they call it um, Tim Crosby because that's where his office is, Derek Lom. Lovely, it looks great in a van too. Very modern, very fresh, very unique. Now the last one, hopefully I can insert a picture right here, but it's the Glossier U. Nice, spicy, woody, floral scent. And that one, there's only one, they don't have any flankers to I know, to my knowledge, but they do have the solid version, not nearly as Instagrammable as the regular perfume version. So I would say check those out if you're looking to purchase for someone the girl who just loves taking pictures, very fashionable. They'll appreciate those fragrances. And until next time, I'll catch you guys. Peace.